if you want to, want to write a script, you can see many different scripts in this toolkit. In fact, terminology. <coughs> uh, D2S has a terminology with Pro provided and model. Uh, Pro is a, bit, a short code inside your codes, and you will trace that. Uh, in, in s it written in functions provided is object uh, logical object which contains uh, many different props. Model is name of application or kernel. It's a short uh, scheme of how it works. <laughs> in user space and kernel spaces, you do different uh, kernel model loaded in the kernel, uh, and different providers also load in the kernel in work via uh, libdtrace lib, and also libproc, and via command line to dtrace providers. Uh, it's available providers on FreeBSD any different platforms depend by kind of our providers because uh, not ported yet on many different systems. Linux has a two and FreeBSD and Solaris and OS X has many different providers to trace drivers and another. Uh, this is, you can run a man one and see command by front end. Uh, is big program to compile and out application, uh, which written a D language. Uh, it's compiled to byte code and load in kernel, which collect information and output in your terminal, and support it in many different platform. But uh, on OS X, it's a bit patched. You need to run the trace to generate a byte code, which Add to binary section, special of which after run we load in the kernel. This is first running application, D2SL. If you run, we will see uh, many different providers which are available in your system. Also, you can run D2SL and flag dash n and d to see our available providers and functions. It's like AVG and start and begin. D language isn't D language uh, as we usually use. It's D language, D to trace. Uh, it uses it uh, as AVG, uh, which has a provider, moduli, function, and prop. Also, predicates, predicates is statement uh, like if in C, and actions some like C, uh, written code, structures, and another. Well, arrow is it's super detail. First, the application. If you run uh, d uh, syscall, open entry, you will see which application. Uh, well, open it a file just, uh, just now. It take one second, it, every one second, uh, our data will copy it from kernel space to user space, it's need to use to save many different uh, things to change context between uh, user space and kernel space memory to save your time. If you run a TCP dump, uh, you, s you will see in top uh, TCP dump has uh, many different uh, resource will be busy because it will copy from kernel to user space. Uh, you can write a profile with different uh, tick and megahertz. How often you will see, you want want to see uh, output built-in variable. Uh, I read a uh, few interesting variable from this race, which included in language. You can see arcs. It, uh, also pro prof you can get name of function or name of provider via pro prof and timestamp and where this timestamp is very interesting if you use a timestamp you will get a timestamp from <coughs> starting and ending execute your code if you use v timestamp it will on cpu it's only which in 
which data review work uh, without time spend it on use it with the trace code only for uh, execute functions aggregate functions you can write uh, aggregate to see how many different ways count scalar sum average and quantities your calls and another tracing applications uh, trace your, you can trace application via the pit provider uh, pit provider is very interesting thing to look at your application if your application uh, build it without uh, user user one static defined traces without modificate code with the trace uh, you can see what it does uh, we it provider it works on freebsd we have liproc uh, and you will see which functions was scaled for example if you use mysql you can see what's request from client to mysql and get information by connect without modification of code. Uh, if you have a laptop, you can don't. Uh, my code is special code, which I have written for presentation and see different, I don't know, internet exists this or not. Yeah, I'm a bit rest, you, you will don't. <laughs> Can I start? Okay. Everybody ready? Okay. Uh, this is first program. If you see, I highlighted uh, green. This is lines uh, for uh, this simple code for uh, length of fast and slow functions to see how many long uh, time it does. It's pretty simple code. is dirty, special for of, uh, looks at code and find the troubles. Uh, this is first provider. Uh, we uh, PIT provider without modification code. Uh, you will run a PIT and then uh, dollar target. Uh, target is kind of number of processor PIT and uh, length and entry. You will see information from string if you will copy in the stir. Arg argument zero is first argument. And you will get a timestamp and self TS is self is object for functions. You can write it to find different between times. Uh, this is next part and it is end of code. And data will collect it in array and count and sum uh, also we will count twice uh, a code to fa to see uh, quantities uh, how many long uh, depended by s uh, length of string to see uh, output profile uh, one time per 10 seconds and then exit it works 10 seconds and then uh, show output from and is like AFC syntax. This is result. Uh, it was uh, count six fast and six slow lines with two functions. Uh, uh, our this is uh, distribution what which can quantize it. You can see how long and ha, uh, how much lines was collected. It's very fast and very slow. First, uh, yes, USDT, uh, 
user can detect, define your providers in the your code. You need to write a simple file in D language and then uh, generate a header file and uh, add the prop, start and stop, or a different way which function w what it traces. You can add arguments, structures, and another. Uh, after run application, generated uh, some code which contain a uh, macros, demo, demo start, enable it, demo start, and demo stop, enable it, and demo stop. And you uh, will run and uh, include your code. And you will see when your function started and when it uh, caused execution. Compile applications different by system. If you use uh, FreeBSD, Solaris, uh, Linux, NetBSD, QNX, you will need uh, run DTRAs to generate object which will attach on your uh, bytecode uh, in section SunV in your binary, the, which will load in kernel when you run application. It will uh, load data before application uh, execute main function in your code. And then this object in one binary is that's all. In first script, if you download files, you can see uh, that. Uh, it was supported uh, many different options. So many options, I not will talk about that. It's a short introduction. And you are uh, probably available if you run DTS L and add name of application as M dash M. And you will get uh, available providers and props. And you can collect data without PIT provider. It will uh, count in your kernel without different uh, modification of code. This is the second de demonstration. Uh, with supporting arguments, you can write a string, uh, int, in 64, and structures, and any different kind of uh, variables. You can see the official documentation and also dependent by system to, to see what you want. And then same steps to get uh, working code. Uh, this is a bit modification. I highlighted a uh, red is a bit function, a smart function to sto uh, very slow code for collecting uh, data and see different between code bits because code so fast. <laughs> Uh, this is a uh, database code, uh, which started to uh, start in time uh, timestamp and change timestamp to zero and print uh, when started application and also as preview uh, collecting data and need to copy in this there is special function for getting from kernel to user space uh, data with lines and strings. And then print it. Uh, the same as preview, not different. It's result by execution. Uh, you also can evolution your interface. If your interface unstable, uh, you want to know uh, and many different uh, admins or. Developers want to s want to see uh, which uh, kind of version of and how it work and what stage and support uh, you write uh, stability via special pragma options that, and your attach attributes and this is the uh, code also show it how to work with f uh, structures. This is structure to see uh, what code does, and this is first library uh, in the trace you need to uh, 
move that library in your dash your cell dash lib dash detrace and in detrace it will available to scripting in this path. Uh, and after run, uh, you can translate your uh, C functions uh, arguments to detrace and show in code. And then you can f get it from short code in detrace. That's all. Like it. Uh, is only structures. It results. Also, if you uh, application level more <laughs> more convenient, you write in code and Ruby not JS and Perl. You want to see what your code does, uh, but uh, libd is supported via libuddt is special external library. I integrated that in NoScale database, which uses uh, uh, OAuth scripts, and it's named as Taranto. It's NoScale uh, in memory like release, but supported in different plugins and uh, a bit popular in Russia. And you also don't want uh, files, but it's a few slides I can uh, fast. Mm. In build it, uh, you can uh, write your providers and start it after uh, running code, and you can stop in at runtime. You need to modify code, uh, C code only for functions inside database. Is a bit example. <laughs> I wrote a function which uh, showed also lines and. Uh, which lines and their length and reference uh, more information big list of uh, presentation and any questions if you have okay uh, that's all that's all Uh, test codes you can do one from uh, link that okay <laughs> I can't because uh, my environment f uh, was saved on my previous job and that's broke after changing the job <laughs> but you can do one and see me it will work perfectly any questions Okay. Uh, for FreeBSD, I recommend to use a Detrace Toolkit to see what your applications does. Uh, it's pretty easy to understand, and you can write uh, short codes and see many different codes to see. Uh, in PHP, my friends uses in PHP, and I'm I'm interesting to integrate in applications. I'm uh, more developer than uh, looking for code and administrate it.
also you can write uh, in Apple instruments attach his external props and see what your application do in future and collect data and see uh, what and see in your code on your functions if you're interested in it. Who is next? Oh, I can't answer these questions because who is written this race is his day, uh, and many different uh, FreeBSD developers uh, supporting Kakot and uh, added new features. And when I did that presentation, I found uh, around uh, five or seven bugs in the kernel modules and uh, reports that, and it will fix it. In but it not fix it yet in 10. It fixed it in 10 stable, uh, not in release. Uh, I know you can write uh, Mark Johnson to more in information. <coughs> That's all. Thank you. Please take out your trash when you leave the room. The next talk will be at 1 p.m., so in 35 minutes.